My name is Monica Woodhouse. I am the CEO of Give a Child a Family and we are based in Margate in KwaZulu-Natal. In 1977, I was working at a children's home. That was when I realized that children's homes were not for children. And I made it my mission in life to make sure that families and parents are going to be able to care for their children better than uh, removing them and putting them into a children's home. So everything that is about child protection, about children's safety, that is our work and our business. The idea is to get them back into families as soon as possible, but we also work with preventative work and getting, uh, helping families to better care for their children and creating safe spaces for children. We believe in the holistic aspects of care. We have a little nursing station here. We have our own social workers who help. They go to school, they have their little programs. So we try and be a, a, an oasis for them when they come here. Well, we didn't think of starting an organization to start with. It was really just a deep desire to see families being restored. We were in a mission station at that stage, at Britannia Mission Station in the 80s when there was terrible violence around and children were being displaced and that was where it kind of like, okay, there's a need here. And that was where we said, okay, well, we've got a house, we can use our house. And we started bringing people into our house, children and families and mothers. In the last three years, we lived with up to 27 people in our house before we actually moved to the center. Achievements through Give a Child a Family, I mean like 32,000 families, 8,000 children, that have been through these programs, 480 staff, 450 volunteers, 350, you know, foster parents. <laughs> support group. Sazana Nabo, Goba, Sofuna Ingan, Mina. I believe for every family you're helping, there's 10 other people you're helping because a family is a nucleus of, of people. I can talk as someone who used to be one of the children but I can also talk as an employee because I collect the stories. So I go and I interview children and I interview parents. And I'll tell you, it means everything. This place is a sanctuary. You come from different backgrounds, abuse, trauma, and you finally find a place where your soul can be at peace. You know, when I'm 80 years old, I want to be able to look back and say, the last 15 years of my life, I've dedicated to making sure that children are safe. We believe it's like a blanket of love <laughs> because love conquers everything. Love absolutely conquers everything and unconditional love breaks down every single barrier. And we have seen that with older children and younger children. They just need to be loved and understood and that is what we've tried to create here, a loving atmosphere. Every child needs one adult who's crazy about them. And that's what, that's what we've got it, trying to create in a small way, but then from here, we move them then into hopefully doting families. These are South African heroes.